Evaluate logarithms. Question 2. Solve for x. x to the power of log 3x equals to 81. Well, this is a very tricky, simple problem, right? I've seen students struggling to solve this one. And what, how are we going to solve it? We are going to take log both sides to solve it, right? That doesn't seem to be a likely solution, but it is. So what we have here is log of x to the power of log 3x equals to 81. So as I said, we'll take log to the base 3 on both the sides. And then what do we get? So we get log to the base 3 of all this, right? So this is x to the power of log 3x, right? Equals to log to the base 3 of 81, correct? Right? Now we'll use the power rule here. So if you use the power rule, we get log 3x times log 3x equals to log 3. And 81 can be written as 3 to the power of 4, correct? Now on the left side, so let me take it on this side of the page to solve it further. So we have log 3x times log 3x. So that is as good as writing log 3x whole square, correct? Which is equals to log 3 of 3 to the power of 4. So using power rule, we have 4 into log 3 of 3, correct? Log 3 of 3 is 1, correct? So we can write the right hand side as just 4, which is log 3x squared. So we'll square root this. Log 3x is equals to, or let me just do it in the next step. So this is equals to 4. And therefore, log 3 of x is equals to plus minus square root of 4. Correct? That is plus minus 2. So we have two solutions here. One is, let me do it in different ink. So one is log 3x equals to 2. And the other one is log 3x equals to minus 2, right? So, if log 3x equals to 2, then what is x equals to? So, we get x equals to 3 to the power of 2, which is 9. And if log, oh, I'm repeating that. So, if log 3x equals to minus 2, then x is equals to 3 to the power of minus 2. Do you see that? Or, is equals to 1 over 9. Do you see? So therefore, we have two possible solutions for this equation. And our answers are x is equals to 9 or 1 over 9. Both fit here in our solution, right? So we have two solutions for this given equation. One is 9. The other one is 1 over 9. And what you need to appreciate here is this, taking log on both sides. So taking log on both sides helps in any kind of exponential equation, right? To solve any kind of exponential equation, we can take log on both sides and solve it. Here, exponent was also log. Even then, it worked. That is what we want to emphasize here, okay? Thank you. I hope you appreciate it.